first up to face the judges is a feisty 24-year-old food server from Los Angeles named Felix. this apron. I'm gonna get it. I'm not gonna beg for it. I'm not gonna tell you a sob story. You just have to taste my food. After their one hour in the prep kitchen, each home cook is then given five minutes to complete their dish in front of the judges. If two judges think a home cook has what it takes, they'll be awarded a Master Chef apron and move on to the next round of the competition. Hello. Good evening, gentlemen. Hi. Hi. Good to see you. First name is? Felix. Felix. Yeah. Okay. Off you go. You got five minutes. And we're gonna cook. Um, I'm gonna make a crispy risotto with a steak tartare on top. Did you just swig out a bottle? Don't be fooled by the cover of the book. Is there a little <laughs> wild firecracker underneath that demure look? Demure look. <laughs> I'm kind of a wild card. I say what's on my mind. I'm straightforward. So say what's on your mind right now. What are you thinking? Joe, you're gonna walk away with the culinary <laughs> after you eat my risotto. <laughs> okay. Hey, love you long time. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Enough. Oh, come on, bring it over. Let's play. Finished? Finished. I'm just gonna slip this off because I'm ready to put on another one. <laughs> As opposed to the spicy tuna, the idea of the beef tartare, where did that come from? Well, it goes more with risotto, and I love steak tartare. Let me just stop you there two seconds. Risotto goes with steak tartare. Well, not that it goes with, but it's more hand in hand than risotto and spicy tuna. Okay. The tartare is under season, so it's sort of almost like it's underwhelming because it's just like a big clump of raw beef. Um, Hmm. Okay. I'm a little dark here. Mm -hmm. It's slightly charred. Great. Thank you. Love the confidence, but it's on the verge of the arrogance because you're not really delivering. For me, it's a no. I couldn't disagree more. I think that well, it's. Um, you disagree or not? I thought I was giving you my version. Um, I thought sorry. it was really good. Fine. I thought the rice was good, crunchy, properly seasoned. The tartare was also good. Oh, I'd like to see more. I'm going to say yes. Thank you. All right. Well, it comes down to me, and here's my thing. You know, I, I do appreciate taking the inspiration of the crispy rice from the sushi world, but I would have rather seen a, a full-on commitment to it, you know, going straight on Asian and getting rid of those other flavors, you know? So it really could go either way. You're going to cry in the tartare. At least you're going to season it. I think you have what it takes, and I want to see more. Yes, come get your apron. Thank you. All right. Don't take things for granted. Don't get too cocky before we even start. All right? Thank you. Good luck. <laughs> Fooled again, JB. Oh, my God. I'm really thankful that they gave me this opportunity. And I have no idea what's coming next, but whatever it is, I'm ready for it.